Hello everyone, and welcome to this tutorial. Today we're going to tackle an interesting Excel challenge, extracting and summing numbers from a single cell. Imagine you have a column of data where each cell contains two numbers separated by a dash, and you want to add up all the numbers that appear before the dash. Sounds tricky, right? But don't worry, I'll walk you through four different methods to achieve this step by step. Let's dive right in. Let us first understand the problem. In our example, we have a column labeled number in column B. Each cell contains two numbers separated by a dash, like 48.02-23155. Our goal is to extract the number before the dash, such as 48.02, and then sum up all these extracted numbers. The challenge is that all the data is contained within the same cell, and there are hundreds of rows in the full spreadsheet. So we need a formula that can handle this efficiently. I'll show you four different methods to solve this problem, and we'll break down each formula step by step so you can understand how it works. Let's start with the first method, which uses the regex extract function to extract the number before the dash. First, we use the regex extract function. This function allows us to extract text based on a specific pattern. In this case, the pattern we're looking for is everything before the dash. So we use this function to extract the number before the dash from the cell. Once we've extracted the number, we need to convert it into a numeric value. For this, we use the double unary operator, which forces Excel to treat the extracted text as a number. Finally, we use the sum function to add up all the extracted numbers. When you enter this formula, Excel will return the sum of all the numbers before the dash in the cell. The second method uses the text before and text split functions to achieve the same result. First, we use the text split function. This function splits the text in the cell into separate parts based on a delimiter. In our case, the delimiter is a line break, char, 10. This splits the cell into individual lines of text. Next, we use the text before function. This function extracts the part of the text that appears before a specific character. Here we use it to extract the number before the dash. Once we have the extracted numbers, we use the double unary operator to convert them into numeric values. Finally, we use the sum function to add up all the extracted numbers. This gives us the total of all the numbers before the dash. The third method involves using the text split and take functions to extract and sum the numbers. First, we use the text split function to split the text in the cell into an array of values. The delimiter here is the dash. This creates an array where the first item is the number before the dash and the second item is the number after the dash. Next, we use the take function. This function allows us to extract specific rows or columns from an array. In this case, we use it to take only the first item from the array, which corresponds to the number before the dash. We then use the double unary operator. Finally, we use the sum function to add up all the extracted numbers. This gives us the total of all the numbers before the dash. The fourth and final method uses the text split function along with a multiplication trick to extract and sum the numbers. First, we use the text split function to split the text in the cell into an array of values using the dash as the delimiter. Next, we multiply the array by a specific pattern. In this case, we multiply the first number by 1 and the second number by 0. This effectively isolates the number before the dash while ignoring the number after it. Once we have the extracted number, we use the sum function to add it up. The sum function calculates the total of the extracted numbers. This method is a bit more advanced but is very efficient for handling large data sets. And there you have it. Four different methods to extract and sum numbers from a single cell in Excel. Each method has its own strengths, so you can choose the one that works best for your specific scenario. Whether you prefer using regular expressions, text functions, or array formulas, Excel has the abilities to make this task simple and efficient. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more Excel tips and tricks. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.